Angie Fox from 38th and Emerson. But how you doing? You've been cracking me up from the moment I walked in the door. Hey, it's America. I'm allowed to speak English, I right? I know that's right. Do it. Uh, Vivica A. Fox right here. The love scene that you filmed that didn't make the movie. All my kisses and and, and gyrating made the movie. So Yeah. 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 You were the homies that you called your brother? You're like, damn. <laughs> You gotta try to pull this shit. You off. are too many things. <laughs> no, I've been fortunate enough that I didn't have any makeout scenes that didn't make the movie. There's a meeting in the ladies' room. <laughs> Homegirl, you was out here shining early with climax. Yes, I was. Of course, you seen it with and dancing with the stars, but she was on Soul Train. Yes, I too was a Soul Train dancer, and God bless his soul and rest in peace, Don Cornelius. Uh, we became really good friends. I hosted several of the Soul Train Awards. Uh, and Hold then, on, why are you over here bragging about the wrong thing, sis? What? Fam, you was in a, a championship basketball team, Yes, son. I was. It was 19, a golden night. Yes, I was. Arlington High School. Yes. Yeah. Was it 80 or 82? Oh, it was 82. Okay. Yeah. When I, when I was graduating. Yeah. yeah. You graduated, then you hung out with some Filipinos out in Cali. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, that's who I still hang out with. Of course, Mass Singer. That was fun. Mm. You've been a you've been a part of a mm. lot of things, but why not? Child, by the end, I had a branch <laughs> growing out the back of like a tree, like you know what I mean, hanging out. It was heavy too. And is is the mic inside? The... Yes. Wow. Yeah, and then you, I the actual face was made out of wood because they they don't want anybody to be able to identify you. Period. But Nick Cannon knew who I was by the smell. As soon yeah. as I came on stage, he's like, I know who it is because oh I wear red gosh. roses. So look at this. So Samuel Jackson been in a lot of projects, and he gives, gave you some game, and you was like, you know. I'm, yeah. I've been cooking, and you've been adding to your IMDb. Yeah. Samuel Jackson definitely was an inspiration for me. He's yeah. one of the hardest working actors that I've ever seen. And he's like, Viv, I was like, how do you do so many projects? And he said, do the work. Don't get caught up in if it's going to be big. Just do the work. And if you do the work, some will make it. Some will be big. Some won't. But yeah. do the work. One of those that a lot of us love and talk about forever is that uh, wonderful set it off. Yeah. Um, now you said the script initially wasn't wasn't as as powerful. Well, thank God for the director F. Gary Gray. So that's what you that's what we you were feel tearing out pages daily. The sequel you're automatically saying yes to. Wow, that's a good question. Oh, two can play that game. Two can play that yeah, game. Yeah, two can play that game. What did it feel like to see your name? On the poster. That, that was the first time that I stopped and made sure I looked at the uh, marquee. That's me. You did, yeah. Did that. You're in the new SZA Kill Bill music video. Mm -hmm. Salute, salute to uh, her and doing all the great things. October will be the 20th anniversary of the film Damn. Kill Bill. Yeah, which time is great. Time is flying by. It's fine. You look fucking amazing. <laughs> Yeah, I need a statue. Mwah, of mwah, mwah. Thank now, you. did you ever train uh, any harder for any other film? No, six months of training went from a size eight ten down to a two. Look at that. That's all we did was work out. I thought we was training for the damn Olympics. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> eight hours a day when we first started. But he wanted us to look official. I'm gonna ask you something. Oh Lord, I'm gonna go there, son, fam. What Sade song were you singing with Whitney? <gasps> What song did I sing with Whitney? Playing spades on the floor of yeah. the Beverly Hills Hotel, Sade. Right. This is no ordinary love. Wow. It's a great memory. Thank you for bringing me that. I'm trying not to cry. That's my girl. Yeah. Man, no energy like that. Yeah, the best. Bobby as well. Yeah. You know what I mean? He was in two can play that game. Now listen, <laughs> sis, I'm going to tell you. Golden Knights. Yes. Right? A Golden West grad. Uh, Huntington Beach, California. Right, yeah, yeah, he was making it happen. Can you see the cast of Set It Off doing a Golden Girls song? Oh my gosh, <laughs> that would be hilarious. I don't know if we'd be setting it off, we might be setting it up. <laughs> <laughs> Did it become too frustrating when everything became about your relationship uh, and not about you being an entrepreneur? Yeah. But, you know, things happen. Those are choices. If I was to ever go back uh, in my career, I would make the choice to never go public with my relationships. That's why I do my best to keep my relationships privately now. Yeah. Huge learning lesson for me and one that I wish I could pass on to some people today. Stop running to Instagram and po posting every damn thing about 
y'all getting along, y'all not getting along, the more private, from what I've learned, that you can keep your relationship, the better it will be yeah. and longer it will last. I love it. Now, uh, interrogation room. Yeah, they picked an African-American sister to host the cases. Some of them really stick with you. The first two that we have coming out were two of the ones that affected me the most. That gas station one was rough, too. And the gas station one, that one was rough, too. Okay, you done done your homework. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. What is one of those films you were a part of that you felt deserved a little bit more love? Why the Fools Fall in Love. Mm. Yeah, I can remember being at the premiere here in New York. They rushed it. They released it too soon. And they said, oh, there's a little film coming out that you won't have to worry about at all. And that little film killed us, and that was Rush Hour. Yeah, look at this. I was like, damn, Chris Tucker <laughs> and Jackie. You almost became the new Miss Cleo, son fam. That almost happened. You uh, dodged yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, let's glad that. We're going to keep keep it moving. <laughs> <laughs> we doing no damn fortune telling. Salute to the loopholes. <laughs> That's no doubt. Now, yeah. uh, yes, she's nice at, at spades. She's nice at Uno. <laughs> he, has he done his homework on me or what? How do you know I'm good at spades? Hey, you know, I, I'm, I'm connected to okay. these streets. Yeah, you yeah, were yeah. talking to Mike Epps or somebody from that town? Uh, once again, Vivica A. Fox. How are they trying to say Vivica that you have to run with Angie? Vavika, Vavisha, oh. yeah, they would blow it. It was real bad. So I would know it was coming. Do you know what I mean? When they started Va, and it's like, you ain't going to get it. So my middle name is Anjanetta. Yeah. So we just shorten it to Angie. And that's what everybody's call me. That's why I know somebody really knows me. When okay. they say, what's up, Angie Fox? You okay. know, and then if they go even further, like you did, Angie Fox from 38th and Emerson, then I, then they know, know me. Let's go. Yeah. Now, listen, you big on ESPN. We about to get out of here. I know oh, you. Oh, yeah. Let me, let me work. Okay. It's right, yo, BJ. I mean, What's he's going just on? just blowing me away. I feel family up in here. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah. If you guys go to Naptown, yo, they need a statue of you. Is there uh, one? Is there, like, is there like there a, is a uh, something? Like, seriously. Wall. Yeah, it's me, Mike on Epps. The wall, what? The handball there, court? Where? Ashley Nora, who is a beautiful artist, uh -huh. um, she painted um, eight Indianapolis figures on a wall. I, I, I'm sorry I don't remember the exact so location. Good. I know me, Mike Epps is on there. There's a jazz guy that's on there and a politician. Fire. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm kind of, yeah, I don't have a statue yet. It's all good. You Start a GoFundMe for it. Go oh, for no, it, Oh, no, no, no. There's one in, in my house. <laughs> There's one in your house? Yes. Do me a favor. Once again, the interrogation room is available mm -hmm. for you guys to check out. Vivica Fox, I got my official blue check. Let me know what you Look think about at it. this. You pay for your blue check? What you doing? No, I got it in the days before you had to pay. Oh, you, yeah, you're a I'm real good. one. Yeah, you a I real know. One. I got What's it. What's the both procedure of them. Instagram. when you get a blue check? Come on. Be quick with it. <laughs> Control your destiny, alter your thinking, and destroy negativity. We right here with a wonderful one. Angie Fox from 38th and Emerson. Mwah.